Hey guys, this is the NGMC Productions, and uh, this is a pretty big video for me, I'm sure for all of you. Um, Spirit Jailbreak was released about within the last 15 minutes or so. As you can see, I've got CD right here. I am running a 3.1.3 third generation 60, no, 32 gigabyte iPod Touch. Right there, 3.1.3. Cydia is completely functional. The jailbreak only took me about literally five seconds. Cydia is working and everything. There's changes, the packages and everything. And uh, I'm going to show you how to do this. So there is a link in the description for you guys to get the jailbreak. It's um, spiritjb.com. Alright guys, there will be a link in the description for the site and how to jailbreak it. Um, once it shows up, it will basically be just a white blank page with text on it. And it'll, it'll, you'll see a Windows and Mac OS X buttons. Just click there to download your thing. Once you download it and you put your desktop, you will see that right there, spirit.exe. Alright, what you gotta do now is plug your iPod, iPhone, or even your iPad, if you do so have one up to your computer by USB cable. Just set that down for now. Alright, so here's my computer screen. There's Spirit. Alright, just wait for iTunes to pop up. You do need an iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad running 3.1.2, 3.1.3, or 3.2 for this to work. Um, and you need iTunes 9.x or higher. 9.0 or higher. Alright, so here's iTunes. I'm just gonna close out of this. Once my computer lets me. Alright, and here is spirit.exe run. And uh, as you can see right there, Spirit Jailbreak. It's got your uh, kind of iPod, iPhone, iPad, whatever. And it's basically just like Black Rain, just click Jailbreak. Back on your iPod here. <coughs> Got the Apple logo. Just gotta wait for that. And then you will see this. It's like a little Starburst thing. I'm not sure, but there's a prog there's a gray progress bar. It's filling up white. So I just let that do its thing. And up here you can see Spirit quit. The jailbreak is done, so I just press quit. Back here, the bar is now filled up. Enter, right, slide to cancel. Whatever. And there we go, and I do have Cydia still. And uh, there we go, that's basically jailbreaking the iPod Touch, iPhone, or uh, iPad. Now, this does not unlock. And I can't do an unlock for video for you guys because one, I don't know how to do it, and two, I don't have an iPhone. So just be look, just be on the lookout for that. All right, and um, yeah, this this is the first time for me too. If it runs for you twice, just ignore it. Um, let it do its thing. This happened for me when I did it the first time. All right, guys, so I'm back and have Cydia still again. You open it up, loading data all your friendly Cydia things. Cydia is now open. Now, um, I've already opened this, so it already has done the, uh, you know when you first open up Cydia, and it's got going through all that, um, downloading all the files, and it restarts for you automatically. That's fine. And, um, here I'm gonna ins update here, so show that's actually working. Download open SSL and all that stuff. This is full functioning Cydia for you right here. Reloading data. You know, this is the first time I've used Cydia on my iPod Touch 3G, and I can tell you right now, it is much faster than my second gen. So, yeah, guys, there you go. Jailbroken. So, that's it for me. Uh, I will see you guys later. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and be on the lookout for more videos. Bye.